Hello everyone, I am here with my 150th recording. It has been an extremely long road for me, and I am glad that I pushed myself through all the hateful comments and other things, um, you know, just to be here and do this. Um, I've enjoyed doing it. So, anyways, skipping past that, subject of the day is the possibilities of uh, The Elder Scrolls VI. So we didn't see Elder Scrolls VI at E3. Instead, we saw a remaster of Skyrim. Uh, I'll skip my opinion of that and we'll go uh, right into um, what's being talked about. So there's plenty of theories out there ranging from uh, you know, the other Elder Scroll Isles or Islands uh, to Test Legends and all this other stuff. However, the one that seems to be the most talked about is Valenwood. So, um, the reason that seems to be the most talked about is because Valenwood is one of the few areas on the main Elder Scrolls uh, area that really hasn't been touched. Uh, in addition to that, there is a legal document from 2014 uh, that kind of indicates uh, that is a possibility. I will show you it here. Um, so if you'll notice on this legal document, um, it's listing Fallout, Fallout 4, Fallout Nuka World, Boston Project, I don't know what that is, Elder Scrolls, which is more likely Elder Scrolls Online, Elder Scrolls VI, and Project uh, Greenheart. So um, like any game company, they use codes to indicate um, their games and you know uh, what's expected of the team working on it in terms of legal uh, agreements. So Project Greenheart is listed, and Valenwood is a forested area of the, t the Elder Scrolls uh, world. So it's likely um, that um, Project Greenheart and Elder Scrolls VI are probably one and the same. They are separated on this document, um, but I get a feeling um, that perhaps uh, maybe they mean that it's going to be focused on Valen Wood. However, Elder Scrolls VI will cover other parts. So maybe Project Greenwood is an added portion to Elder Scrolls VI. We don't know yet, um, but that's just the, the legal document. Now let's look at the... Um, Elder Scrolls map. Now this does not include the islands and isles, which there are a bunch of them uh, not listed in the uh, main map. I think there's like six of them. Well anyways, point is, is that you can see that um, here is everything um, that has been touched. We've seen uh, Black Marsh, Cyrodiil, uh, Marwind, um, Skyrim, and a couple of the others in here. Cyrodiil was um, Oblivion, and Marwyn was um, Test 3, Skyrim was Test 5. Um, so yeah, there's um, a likelihood of it being Valenwood. But um, we have to wait and see what's said um, officially by uh, Bethesda. Now, as far as what Bethesda has said, um, they have confirmed that Elder Scrolls 6 is on uh, their to-do list. Uh, they did basically say that the reason they unveiled um, the Skyrim remaster um, at E3 uh, was really just to give them a buffer. Uh, they weren't ready for Elder Scrolls 6 um, to be revealed at E3 2016. So instead, they decided to um, give the player base something else, and that is uh, the remaster, which will allow um, a much higher definition version of Skyrim uh, to be installed on uh, the consoles, and also to give them mod support. Um, so that's really where we're at. Um, that's all I have. Thanks for listening.